Hey, good morning, Kata Springs. My name's Chad, I'm the youth pastor here. Hey, we're so stoked you came here this morning. And if you're visiting, maybe for the very first time, what we want you to do is when you came in this morning, you got a little bulletin. On the side of it is a connection card. Just fill out your info on that, rip it off, throw it in the offering at the end of service. And then when you do that, we're actually gonna mail you a little Starbucks card. It's just our way of saying, hey, we're so stoked you came and have a drink on us. Hey everybody, it's September and it's time for small groups. What are small groups? Let me tell you what they are. It's couches and porches and kitchen tables. It's stories that are shared and moments that are worth remembering. It's hoping and praying and, and even taking chances. It's jokes and laughters and sometimes a shoulder to cry on. It's questions and answers and even I don't knows. It's knowing that you don't have to figure it all out by yourself. It's serving and growing better together. It's life, and we weren't meant to do it alone because life is better together. Small group registration happens throughout through the end of September. You can either go online and check it out or you can come and talk to me. I'll be outside in the courtyard, but no matter what you do, I would just love you to get involved. Pull up a chair, grab a seat, and do life together with other people. It's absolutely worth it. In the 60s, there's a sexual revolution. Now, with the advent of Netflix and HBO and all kinds of movies and internet, feels like we're living in a sex tsunami. Are you drowning? We just released a podcast episode called Living in a Sex-Centric Culture on our podcast, 10 Steps Further. If you're interested in learning how you might be able to navigate these waters, just click over the link in the description and take a listen. I think you'll like it. Hey, I wanna tell you about the Sponsor a Youth Fundraiser. It is one of our biggest fundraisers we do in the youth group. It's how we raise half of our fiscal budget. Here's what I need you to do. Come out after service day in the courtyard, talk to Nikki or myself, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab a card. It's gonna have a kid's face on it. It's gonna tell you about what school they go to, what grade they're in, and then what you do is you commit to praying for them throughout the whole year. So throw it in your Bible, put it on their fridge, just somewhere where you're gonna remember and be able to commit to praying for the student. And then we're asking for a suggested donation of 100 bucks. If you, if you can only do less, that's fine. If you can go above and beyond, that's great. We just invite you to join us and partner with us with the Sponsor Youth Fundraiser. So come talk to us after church today. We'd love to hang out with you. Ladies of Canyon Springs, we have a fun book club that is coming and we want you to be a part of it. Starting on Monday, October 14th, we're gonna be meeting at Debbie Eccles' house and we are gonna be going through a book called Lineage of Grace. Um, there are five mini novellas and each novella tells a story from a woman who is from Je Jesus' lineage. So come, be a part of that, log on to our website, find out all the information, and we would love to have you be there. All right, hey, one last thing. Uh, if your children or husbands are not enjoying the service as much as you are, we do live broadcasts outside for a better environment. If you could go ahead, please silence your cell phones, and then any of these events you want more info about, just visit us at kadiansprings.org.